I'm a wild breeder. This story is about 52 herds wild and die. I kept it. Actually, it took me in first. In addition to me, it also kept billions of people. Of the billions of people, I was the only one who bathed and fed it every day, and I was the only one who can hear its voice. I often share stories with people which I heard from the wild. Human usual desire of at the end of story, but no one believed that. They also seem not to notice that they live just like actors in the stories, following the storyline, but not seeing the ending. As for the reason why humans will perish, it was all their selfishness and desire. Air, ocean, and land pollution are getting more serious year by year. The frequency of natural disaster is getting higher and higher, and the scale is getting bigger than before. Humans complain about the ruthlessness of nature. It is not only destroying their construction, but also taking their life. I found that the wild health getting even worse too. It hadn't spoken for a long time which worried me. Until that day, I heard it sound. I truly heard it. It says, let's go. In this way, we leave the pollution of environment and the hearts of the people and my past behind. Since ancient times, when the habitat have been threatened, we were temporarily flat here, the wild said. I can't help but consider back into my stories. For a while, it goes on saying, there will be an unprecedented catastrophe on Earth. I will die in it, and everything will return to its original form. No, that happened before. I'm the only survivor, I said. I inherited my family business, making a amount of money from wilding. I got everything I wanted. Until one day, I saw that there were no wilds on Earth. Soon after, a disaster occurred and I became nothing. The scene of the disaster back to my mind. I blame this for all my mistakes on nature. Because of it, I lost everything. But when I looked around, I found that what I had done was more terrible than the natural disaster. It took a long time for the earth to come back to life. Then I met the wild. Then you choose to change. He looks to the earth and said, How many people will wake up from the disaster this time? How many times will be repeated this disaster? I witness the deteriorating earth is about to be destroyed, and the weakness wild too. I realize how much it affected the environment. Even if I chose to change, I couldn't make up for those evils. The world know more than me that what I have done before, but it doesn't care much about that. Just as I trapped it in infinite guilt, the world seemed to hear my inner voice. It said, you don't have to think like this and worry about your past. The impact of the change you've made is far greater than the damage done by the past. Thank you for your change and everything you've done for me. That was the last word the wild said to me. After that, everything is back to the original again. This time, how will it end? I'm a wild keeper. This is a story about a wild and die, and it still continues.